haze, smoke, and no sign of flames. It created some confusion for people in Orange County. What we are learning about the fire believed to be responsible. It has been an active start to the fire season in Central Florida. Good evening, I'm Lisa Bell. Yeah, glad you're with us tonight. I'm Matt Austin. Some of those fires have been planned, while others have started without warning. So if that was the case for one fire tonight in Volusia County. Take a look. Daytona Beach Fire Department says this fire at Indigo Lakes started with a cigarette. Firefighters were able to contain that fire and put it out, but it was a different story this afternoon in Orange County. News Six's Treasure Roberts joins us now. So Treasure, the fire there was actually planned and controlled, but it caught people off guard. It sure did, and they may have seen big smoky clouds hovering over their neighborhoods, but fire officials say that shouldn't have been a cause for concern. It's a result of something called a prescribed burn, which experts say actually protect communities. It was everywhere. I just couldn't tell from where it was coming from. You're not alone if you saw a haze on your daily commute or even outside your front door. I was going to a dentist appointment, and then I started driving and could notice it was really foggy everywhere. Multiple people posted concerns on social media Monday saying they saw thick, dark smoke that smelled of fire. Keith Malzo, a representative with the Florida Forest Service, says it could have been caused by a prescribed burn. They were burning a large area. It could send smoke down into Orange County and further before it completely dissipates and leaves the area. FFS posted this Monday afternoon alerting Orlando residents of a nearly 2,000 acre burn in the Ocala National Forest. Warning, smoke from the burn drifted toward Orlando, but it's not here to stay. Wind's supposed to stay up a little bit tonight, so it'll keep moving everything out of the area. Mouso says prescribed burns happen throughout the year. It protects communities by preventing big disasters like wildfires. With all the vegetation being fought for us here right now, we are, uh, we are very susceptible and it easily ignites and burns at this time of year. They're removing hazardous fuels that easily ignite under wildland fire conditions. The burns will usually cause a light haze and a smoky smell. Folks need to just, if, if they're having that issue, close their windows, turn their air C AC on, and, and stay inside as best they can. Hopefully it's not so bad that it impacts them in their health. The also does say people who have respiratory conditions like asthma may be impacted by the smoke. Also, drivers are urged to take caution if the smoke causes low visibility in their area. In Orange County, Treasure Roberts getting results. News 6. Treasure, thank you.